Kai Bideri I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around So little And we keep track of time Being so serious Idiots Thinking it will matter Keep me company downtown Before the clock runs out Sun is shining but the rain is welcome too Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember All things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not gonna wake up Hey y'all, so I'm going to be sharing a Saturday in my life in today's video. And before I get too far, I wanted to let y'all know that it is in collaboration with one of my good YouTube mama friends, Ashley. And I'm going to go ahead and let her introduce herself now. Hey guys, my name is Ashley and I'm a stay-at-home mom to four kids. I live in West Texas and on my channel, I love sharing motivational motherhood content like shop with me's, grocery hauls, fitness, cleaning, and so much more. So if you enjoy relatable motherhood content, I hope after you get done watching this beautiful mama's video, you head on over to my channel and check my video out. If you like what you see, I hope you hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. I honestly have the best community of uplifting and supportive women, and I would love to have you a part of that. My link will be down in the description below, and I really hope to see you guys soon. Hey y'all. <coughs> you okay? Yeah. <laughs> hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. So today is Saturday and we just had a fail. So Adeline's basketball banquet pizza party was supposed to be this weekend. So we get in the car, we get ready. I'm rushing out the door to get her there on time. We get there. Nobody's there. There's like one vehicle in the driveway. Um, we go up there and the lady's like oh it's tomorrow so her pizza banquet party was supposed to be tomorrow on sunday so my plan was to drop her off at her uh, pizza party for her basketball and then i was going to go to target because y'all look no kids because i left them with eric and i never ever 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 get a break with no kids unless i'm like taking one of them to like the dentist or something i'll ask my mom to sit with the ones that don't have to go to the dentist but usually i'm never kid free so i was going to be kid free <laughs> but her basketball banquet is actually tomorrow and not today but that's okay because that just gives us a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time to hang out together um anyways i was gonna go to target today that's where i'm at right now we just pulled up at target we're about to run in here and i'm gonna take y'all uh around the store with me shopping with me a little bit i'm just gonna take y'all through my day on a saturday i wasn't planning on filming today but i just decided to pick up the camera and those usually make the best videos the spur of the moment videos usually make the best videos but anyways we're gonna take y'all shopping with us and eric requested a java ship frappuccino from starbucks so he doesn't know that i was going to come to target but i was i was going to come to target for a minute kid free just to get a breather and i have a really cool new toy for the kids that i want to share with y'all it's not a sponsorship but it was sent to me from a company to test and review eric's actually at home right now building it with the baby and two toddlers so he gets a little glimpse of my life when i'm trying to do stuff at home and you got all the kids around you so we'll get a little taste of what i go through every day but we're about to head into target now
71 degrees today and a beautiful day. Hi, can I get um, three grande java chip frappuccinos, one of them non-caffeinated, no coffee? A while back, one of my friends actually told me that they get their kid a non-caffeinated drink at Starbucks because Adeline was asking me for a Starbucks and I was like, well, I don't really want to buy you coffee. You know, you're 11, you don't need a coffee. And she was like, well, my friend gets one all the time. She gets a non-caffeinated coffee at Starbucks. So I was like, oh, so a while back we started getting Adeline Starbucks without coffee. So any mamas out there that have kids that are older and they really want a Starbucks, you can order it non-caffeinated and they'll, like we just ordered the Java Chip Frappuccinos. They're so good. It's what I get, usually what I get all the time. It's what Eric loves too, but I got Addy one with no coffee coffee in it. We got the peppermint. It was the peppermint mochas. That's what I like to get around like Christmas time. It just it's like a pepperminty like Christmas holiday drink it tastes like to me but like any other time I'll just get like the java chip. And I'm also planning a spring clean and decorate video. So I stopped at the Target dollar spot in there. We didn't go anywhere else in the store. We just stayed at the Target dollar spot and they had the absolute cutest things for Easter and they were actually stocked. A lot of times I'll go in there to the dollar spot and everything's already been ran through and everything's gone and stuff's missing, but they actually had it pretty stocked this time. I was really excited about it. I know Easter's not, you know, until a ways away, but I like to upload my clean and decorates, my holiday clean and decorates a little bit early so I can give you guys some inspiration and like decorating ideas. So I, I do like to decorate a little bit early so that I can, you know, inspire you guys. But I'm so excited to share an Easter, like a spring clean and decorate with me with all of my new Easter decor. Plus I'm gonna be using my um, Easter decor that I have from last year as well. Delicious. You like yours? What do you think? Delicious? Chocolatey? It's good. <laughs> other kids with me and every time I drive past this this building I'm always like I really want to take a picture with that butterfly y'all can see right here there's a butterfly painting on this wall and I always want to stop and take a picture with it but I'm never brave enough and I have all the kids with me so I can't anyway so it's just me and Addie this time so I'm about to get her to take my picture with this butterfly and I'm gonna take her picture because what? it's the perfect opportunity <laughs> Nolan, you don't want any pizza? No. You want a A YouTube mama friend her name is Tammy Sutherland and she actually has her own small business called Lux Butter Bar and she creates her own scents of like body sprays and bath bombs and all kind of pamper products so I'm gonna link her channel down below as well as her small business so you guys can head on over and check her out but she actually sent me one of her boxes to try out and smell and I'm really excited to get them out and see how I like them and if y'all hear a bunch of hollering in the background it's just my kids they're fine they're out there with Eric so I'm gonna come back here and show you guys these products in my bedroom where it's a little bit quieter 
So it's really nicely packaged. She put some bubble wrap and it's also got some hot pink tape in a really pretty white box. So cute. It says self care is self love. I love that. I love how it's packaged. So cute. Love your skin. You are worth it. It's a little sticker. How cute. I love that. Minding small business. And I have a personalized card. It says, hey beauty. And it has my name, Marie. So this one is a handmade soap. It's like swirled colors together. It says cleansing, refreshing, and moisturizing. And then this is another handmade soap called Fruit Loops. This is the Pineapple Strawberry Smoothie Lip Scrub. This one I'm so, so excited to try out. I love trying out new lip scrubs. The one I have is almost gone. That's what it looks like. Oh my goodness, y'all, that smells so good. It smells just like strawberry pineapple. I also have the Butter Bar Peach Me. This is a foaming sugar scrub. I'm so excited to see what these smell like. That's what it looks like. It looks very like whipped creamy. Oh my goodness, y'all, that smells amazing. Okay, this one is the Whipped Body Butter Peach Me, and then this one is the foaming sugar scrub, and they smell so, so good. She also sent me the Peach Me Body Mist, as well as the Revitalizing Body Oil in the Peach Me. And I also have some Strawberry Pineapple Smoothie Lip Butter. And this is a good size too. And her prices are so good. When you guys go head over to her business website, you're gonna see the prices. They are so good. And then she also sent me a Peach Me Bath Bomb. So this is everything that she sent over to me. Everything smells amazing. I am never gonna deceive you guys and lie and say something smells good. If it doesn't, Tammy, these scents smell so good. Good job, girl. I'm so proud of you. I cannot wait to use my Bath Bomb. The Peach Me scent smells so, so delicious. The Pineapple Strawberry Smoothie also smells delicious. I just absolutely love these little stickers. So cute. Thank you so much, Tammy. I'm gonna link Tammy's small business down below my description box so you guys can head over show her some love and make sure you let her know that Marie sent you over. And while I have a quick minute, I wanted to thank y'all from the bottom of my soul for 13,000 subscribers. I'm blown away. I'm speechless. You guys seriously have just blown me away with all of the thoughtfulness, all of the kindness, all of the sweet comments and prayers, just all of the new people that have come across my channel and have introduced yourself. And if you haven't introduced yourself and you would like to, I would love it if you would leave me a comment introducing yourself a little bit. I love to get to know my subscribers. I am seriously just blown away with the amount of love and support that I have been shown on this YouTube channel. And it just really inspires me and encourages me to keep going with my channel because I know that you guys are really enjoying my content. And I really want to keep on bringing and putting out that content for y'all. Thank y'all so, so much. Like, I don't even have any other words other than just to share how grateful i am for you guys i will never take my channel and my subscribers for granted i seriously love y'all so much and i cannot thank y'all enough it look like a rainbow. yeah it's called fruit loops it's fruit loops hand soap you want to use it yeah you wash your hands with it yeah, yeah. I want, they're about to have I, fun with this bubble wrap I want that <laughs> we'll do that in a minute. I can't pop it. Mm, that peach me smells so good. I sprayed it on Bella. What do you think? You like the smell? Mm -hmm. What's the body oil? I what, what is mm. this? That's a back bomb. Mm, what do you think? I like. I like. It. That smells good, doesn't it? I like. A bit I like a strong it. peach. It smells really strong good. Strong peach. Strong I peach. Lie, I Looks lie. like whipped cream. Okay, we're getting ready to go out and show you guys our brand new toy. Are y'all so excited? Mm -hmm. You are? Oh, Bella wants to show y'all her heart sunglasses from Pat Pat. You love them? Y'all, she was wearing them last night. We were watching Harry Potter. And she was sitting on the couch wearing her sunglasses in the dark watching Harry Potter. That's how much she loves them. And then this is one of Nolan's Pat Pat outfits. It's like 71 degrees today, so he's got shorts on. And Bella just wanted to wear her winter boots, even though it's 70 degrees. But how cute is this outfit? It has paint splatters. One of my last vlogs, I did a toddler girl and boy Pat Pat haul. If y'all want to check that out. What? Okay, Jackson's waking up and getting a little bit ill, but I wanted to share my 
Target dollar spot spring haul with y'all. So I found this Easter Bunny charcuterie board. It was $5. Everything was $5 or under in the Target dollar spot. And then I found this ceramic dish tray. And then I have this two pack of hand towel set. It says Hello Sunshine. I love the colors and it has little tassels on it. And then you have just the plain green. And then I can't wait to share the way I'm going to be decorating this little basket bicycle. It's going to be so cute. And then I bought three ceramic white bunnies. This tray is so cute. It's a wooden tray with like an Easter Bunny ears on it and this is a metal and then this is a easter egg garland with greenery two wooden bunnies and then this is the candle called clover fields it smells really really good so i can't wait to share with you guys the way i'm going to be decorating this spring i also have more spring decor that i've had for the previous years and i'll probably buy just a little bit more So this is their new toy it seats two toddlers and it comes with a transmitter controller that you can drive your kids around yourself it can go forward backwards you can turn it this is the speed so they can drive it themselves, or you can use the transmitter controller and since it's new and they don't really know how to drive it yet at first we're gonna steer them with this and then we're gonna teach them how to drive it you excited yeah. you excited yeah. you're gonna take turns driving yeah. cool Okay, let go. That's how you start it and turn it on. It has LED tail lights and headlights. It's hard to see because it's daylight, but there's LED lights right here. So if you put it in neutral, that's how you use the transmitter. Or if you put it in drive or reverse, then they can use the pedal. And then you can connect your phone to this and actually play music through it. And again, it's hard to see because it's bright out here, but it's got lights on the dash. Now you want to blow the horn. <laughs> It has a horn. The right yeah. Music. The right one plays music. <laughs> He's dancing. <laughs> hey, buddy. Is it bumpy? No one. So Eric was driving them at first, but now we're letting them take turns learning how to drive it. Tur turn so it. they've got to learn how to drive it. No one. Drive it, come on. Here you go. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Okay. All right, it's Bella's turn. Let's let Bella have a turn, okay? Can you open it? Good job, Nolan. Okay, let's buckle up, okay? Baby duty. So Eric is still outside with the kiddos. They are taking their bikes out now. So he's going to be in the cul-de-sac driving his Traxxas RC cars while they ride their bike. But I'm going to go ahead and try out the Lux Butter Bar Pineapple Strawberry Smoothie Lip Scrub. And then I'm going to pair it with the Strawberry Pineapple Smoothie Lip Butter. And I'm going to see how I like these. So I have been using the St. Ives Lip Scrub in the Juicy Watermelon. It's 100% natural sugar and this one is from Target. And I really love this one, but it's really, really 
thick and more creamy and I feel like it leaves like a red residue on my lips. This one went on and scrubbed my lips really smoothly and it didn't leave any residue or any color which I really love. So I definitely love this one a lot more than the St. Ives. The lip butter made my lips feel like heaven. It smells really good. It tastes delicious. Both of the products taste very delicious. Tammy, thank you so much for sending over your products. I absolutely love them. I love, love, love the peach scent. It smells so good. The strawberry pineapple scent smells so good and it tastes so delicious. The girl, your shop is on fire i absolutely love the products and i know that my subscribers will too if you guys want to head over and check out tammy i'm actually getting ready to give jackson his bath so i'm going to go ahead and get his bathtub and all his bath supplies together yeah. and i'm actually not using his sling anymore so i decided to stop using his sling in the bathtub because every time i put him in the sling he absolutely hated his bath and now he's got pretty good head control and so I took the sling out and gave him a bath without it and he sat in it just fine. Obviously I have to sit next to him, but he doesn't like fall over in the water and stuff. And he seemed much happier, like he was more content and seemed like he was kind of playing in the bathtub um, whenever I didn't put the sling in. So I'm not gonna be using the sling in his little bathtub anymore now that he's three months old. school when they met and things got kind of awkward with sparks in the air he would stare at her in class and she would try to act cool i think he's tired so i'm about to give him his bath and then i'm going to rock him to sleep and he'll usually go to sleep for a little while every night around seven and eight o'clock is when he's ready for bed like he wants to go get in his like bassinet swing and go to sleep and he'll sleep until about 10 or 11 o'clock and he'll wake up and eat and then he'll wake up again between 2 and 3 o'clock and then he sleeps until about 5 or 6 o'clock and then he wakes up around 7 or 8 for the day and since Eric's outside with all the other kids I'm going to go ahead and get my shower when I get out I'm going to try out my new whipped body butter I'm so excited to try it out and the um, body oil and then we're going to be watching a Harry Potter movie with the kids and having some popcorn that's our plans for the evening so just a few baby bath essentials. I highly recommend this foam bath mat for your knees when you're giving your babies and toddlers baths. This came from Walmart. I bought this when Nolan was a baby. And this is the set from Target that I've been using for his uh, cradle cap. It looks a ton better. There's just like a tiny bit left. Everybody tells me to use coconut oil. So that's another option if you're dealing with cradle cap. And then this is like a muslin washcloth. I love these washcloths. I hate the little tiny ones that you get from like Walmart and they're just so small and they shrink up. I absolutely love these washcloths. I can link them down below if y'all are interested in them, but I highly recommend the muslin washcloths and the burp cloths. This one is the washcloth. The burp cloth is just longer. And then this is the rinse cup I use and I've used it for a while. It's from Walmart. It's Munchkin brand. And in my opinion, this toy bar is a must-have for the bathtub. I got this from Target and I absolutely love it. I put all the kids' shampoos in it and all their toys. And it also has drain holes in it so that water can escape. And after his bath, I just comb his hair with a soft brush. And then this is the lotion I use. I've used this for several years. I use it on my toddlers as well. And I also use this Shea Moisture Baby Wash. We absolutely love this stuff. It smells so good. And it's free of all the harmful stuff. What you doing? <coughs> really? So as you can see, they're still out there. There's Bella in the driveway. There's Nolan riding his bike. And Eric's out there driving his Traxxas RC car. And Addie was out there riding her bike, but she just came in. So since Jackson finally fell asleep in his swing, usually right after his bath, he likes to go to sleep and he sleeps really hard right after his bath because I feel like he feels so clean and he feels so fresh that it helps him sleep better. So he's asleep right now in his swing and they're all outside. So I'm going to go ahead and take this moment to jump in the shower. But it was obvious like who? Should get an ouchie. Yeah. My goodness. Get a band aid. Okay, let me clean it, okay? okay. Oh, I'm sorry you got hurt.
Where's your ouchie? Right here? Okay, let's put some peroxide on it. So I put some peroxide on him. He fell and scraped his knee outside. I'm also going to be putting on some triple antibiotic. This is just like some Neosporin. And one day she said, write me a love song. Cause I know you'll make it beautiful. And maybe I'll call you my sweetheart. So I literally just got out of the shower and heard Nolan come inside crying. So I had to come nurse him up in my towel. So I'm going to go get dressed now and finally get to use my lotion that I've been dying to use all day. Sorry about the lighting. It's dark outside now, but this is like the comfiest set from Walmart. Go over to the Walmart's women's section and see if you guys can find some of these pajama sets because they are so comfortable. I have this one in black and white and then I also have the cheetah one. You probably have seen me wearing it in my vlogs. And then I'm just wearing these super cozy socks from Amazon. But these pajamas come right below my knee. They're so comfortable. I actually got these for my hospital bag whenever I went to go have Jackson. I just opened up this soap for the girls. It's called Fruit Loop and it's round and fruity like Fruit Loop and smells super fruity and super good. And then we're gonna rub some soap in it. Awesome. <coughs> Who is that? Are you talking? Are you talking? Yeah. So I'm gonna use the Peach Me Body Oil on I think my arms and rub it in and then I'm gonna use the peach me whipped body butter for my legs and I'll let you guys know how I like them So this was an absolute hit for me in the shower. This is the foaming sugar scrub. Absolutely loved it and I feel so pampered. So the overall quality, appearance, and scent of Lux Butter Bar it gets an A plus from me. I absolutely love it. But I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I'm about to give the kids a bath and we're going to start our movie and have our popcorn. Thank y'all so much for hanging out with us on this Saturday. Love you guys so much and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye.